What's good everybody? Welcome back to Cadillac Cartoons and today I'm going to show you how to draw the female torso at a front view. So let's get started. So the first thing I'm going to need is a ruler. I'm just going to line it up with the center of my page and draw a line down. Because we'll need a line of symmetry to do this. And the first thing that we're going to need are two lines close to the top. And that's going to be the neck. Okay. And then now to draw the female torso, we're going to need two trapezoids. So we're going to make one that's going to be upside down. And it's just going to be right underneath these two lines. So just draw an upside down trapezoid that's about this big. looking pretty good so let's move down a little bit and we're gonna draw another trapezoid that connects with this part of the trapezoid but now this one is gonna be right side up and it's gonna be a little bit smaller so just do the same thing pretty much my symmetry is a little off but that's okay But that is both our trapezoids. Okay, and now I'm going to take my kneaded eraser. I'm just going to erase these lines a little bit. Just so we can still see them. Okay, and these two as well. Let me just... And then I got to redraw my line of symmetry real quick. There we go. Okay, and now with my pencil, I can now go on the outer edges of this trapezoid, actually right there at the corners. And I'm actually gonna begin to draw the breasts. So just uh, two big water balloons. This actually looks like half a water balloon too, so you can just draw those on each side of the line of symmetry or on each side of the corners. like that and then follow the trapezoid lines coming in okay and then for the bottom trapezoid instead of making a straight line like we did for our guidelines we're actually gonna make a curve around those lines so we're actually gonna make a curve that comes all the way to the bottom like that and keeping things symmetrical, we can do the same thing on the other side. Like that. Okay. And then right here where the line of symmetry and the bottom part of our trapezoid kind of intersect, that's going to be the crotch. So we can just draw in like a letter V shape down here to help indicate that. And then right here where our line of symmetry is, that's going to be the inside of the legs. So I'm just going to make two curves coming off of our, off our V shape to show that those are the legs. And I'm making this curve come in a little bit. Like that. Okay, then I'm just going to draw like another V shape over here to indicate that she's wearing some sort of underwear. But to make things easy, let's draw her in a bathing suit. So I just made that blue, darken those lines. You can make it any color you want or you can use your graphite pencil, but I ended up using this, so that's okay. And then I'm gonna add a couple wrinkles here. Okay, and now let's come back up to the top where we drew our neck. I'm gonna darken those lines real quick. And then we can begin to draw the arms. So let's come off of one of these uh, necklines. Let's curve around our trapezoid shapes and begin to draw our arms. Now both the top portion and the bottom portion of the arms plus the hand will stop at the mid thigh, which will be right over here in this area. So let's start by making the guidelines for our arms by drawing a circle right here for the shoulders. 
drawing a line down and then drawing another line that's the same length and then from this dot to this X that I drew down here that's gonna be the length of the hand okay and now we can begin to construct the arm so I have to come off of this curve here And then I'm going to make this into a cylinder. And then when I'm drawing the bottom part of the arm, I like to curve out. And then back in. So that way the length of this portion of the arm compared to this one will be a little bit smaller. And then do the same thing on the other side of the arm. Like that. And then I'm just going to draw in any kind of hand movement here but if you do want to learn from me how to draw the hand i got three videos on how to draw different hand movements two of them are public here on youtube the other is exclusive on my patreon so there will be two links to those videos in the description down below and there will also be a link to my patreon so you can get to that third how to draw hands video but this is the hand that i drew for this video and now let me get to the other arm and hand and get to drawing that but I'm gonna do that in time lapse real quick so that way I don't make the video super long so let's go all right and having done being that let me zoom back out so I can show you guys our progress so far and there we go all we have left to do is since I said my character is wearing a bathing suit we can just further express that by making a couple handles up here or straps, bra straps, whatever they're called. You can make um, a little collar line over here. That further shows that my character is wearing, wearing a bathing suit. And then a couple lines down here that show where the breasts are. And after doing that, we're pretty much done. That's how you draw the female torso at a front view. So if you liked the video or if you found it useful, give it a like and a comment. Subscribe if you haven't and tap the notification bell so you never miss an upload. And I'll see you in my next video. I